Huh. And so with chronic pain, you know, and, and especially if you if you're looking at um, people who are going to be looking at psilocybin or these you know therapies to begin with, you know, it might be looking at anxiety, depression, things like that. I guarantee that there's a you know an underlying some form of pain that they're dealing with physical. Mm -hmm. um, and right. So this is you know, my take on it is you heal the body, you're going to heal the mind. Mm -hmm. um, and a lot of that's going to be coming through regulating the vagus nerve, um, you oh. know, just helping regulating, just kind of bringing the body back to a homeostasis. Uh, there's like I was talking about the KCC2, it's called the potassium ion channel. That gets yeah. down regulated whenever there's, um, you know, chronic pain involved and there's an upregulation of the 5-HT2 receptor. Um, and so when you're using that agonist, you know, it's just kind of, you know, helping bring everything kind of back level again. And I guess that's kind of where I'm thinking, you know, when they talk about upregulation of cells. And by I'm, I have zero, like, formal training in any of this. 